Hello everyone and hello again YouTube. This is Mia with ES Marketplace News and I'm back to give you another article featured on today's newsletter on preferredcurrency.news. But um, before we start, just a quick reminder that we are not financial advisors and we highly recommend that you do your own research regarding the information we provide for you to make decisions for yourself. Now, this channel, EOS Marketplace News, and the website, preferredcurrency.news, is simply a gathering of the rumors and research available online each day. Okay, so let's go to the second article featured on today's newsletter, which is about here. The Top 5 Crypto Performers Overview, which is Stellar, Ripple, Neo, Cardano, and EOS. Okay. Okay, here. Now, on October 15, some market participants dumped stablecoin Tether as its CEO, who is also the CEO of Bitfinex, faced rumors of insolvency of both companies. Tether briefly lost its peg to the U.S. dollar as the traders sold it and lapped up other cryptocurrencies, providing a temporary boost in the total crypto market capitalization to about $220 billion. However, after the initial frenzy, most digital currencies gave up their intraday gains and stabilized at lower levels. Though most of the top cryptocurrencies are stuck in a range, there are a few that are showing signs of bottoming out. Let's look at the top 5 digital currencies with a market capitalization of $1 billion or more, which have risen the most in the past 7 days. Now, first is XLM USD. Stellar bagged the pole position by gaining about 15% in the past 7 days. There were a couple of events that have helped it rise in a dull market. Rumors were making rounds that the new platform for institutional investors launched by the multinational financial industry heavyweight Fidelity will use XLM blockchain for moving digital assets. The list of XLM on the CoinSuper crypto exchange has also been well received by the investors. Another positive news was the announcement of a partnership between Stellar and cryptocurrency exchange Hyperion, a subsidiary of a Canadian firm Global Blockchain Technologies. Can Stellar maintain its momentum or is it nearing critical overhead resistance? Let's find out. Now, the XLM or USD pair topped out of the first week of this year at 0 0.98 or 9823 dollars. And since then, it has been in a downtrend. It is currently trading inside a descending triangle, which will complete, complete on a breakdown and close below the support. However, on the downside, the bearers haven't been able to sustain below $0.184 in 2018. The digital currency is bound off its critical support three times already. Repeated failure of the bears to break down of a level is a positive sign. It shows accumulation by so strong hands when price corrects to its levels. Now, if the bulls continue their purchases at higher levels and break out on the downtrend line of the triangle, it will invalidate the bearish pattern. A failure of a bearish pattern is a bullish sign. Therefore, a close above the triangle is likely to attract buying and start a new uptrend that can carry XLM to $0.47 and above that to $0.63. Our bullish view will be negated if the bears break down and sustain the price below $0.184. XRP USD The second best performing cryptocurrency that is showing almost double digit growth is Ripple, uh, which has been in the past in the news this whole month. 
Corey Johnson, chief market strategist at Ripple Labs, has suggested that the White House might be interested in publishing or pushing XRP adoption to counter China's dominant position in the Bitcoin mining industry. On October 17, the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation Deputy Director and Principal Technologist Miller Abel announced a partnership with Ripple Labs Incorporated and digital payments firm Coil. With several positive news to help the price action, Ripple has made a small comeback this week. Can this continue or will the coin give up in its uh, recent gains? The XRP USD pair has been in a downtrend in 2018. It has repeatedly failed to hold on to the support levels and has been making new lows at regular intervals. Currently, it is trading below both the 20-week EMA and the 50-week SMA, but, the, but is trying to form a higher low at $0.37185. The previous low was $0.25300. Now, if the bulls succeed in pushing the price above $0.76440, it will indicate a probable bottom and might signal the art of a new uptrend. The higher levels to watch on the upside are $0.96 and $1.22. On the downside, if the currency or cryptocurrency breaks down of $0.25, it can sink to a new low. We believe that traders should wait for buying to emerge before initiating any long positions. NEO USD NEO celebrated the second anniversary in their mainnet launch and the market cheered the event by pushing the price higher by 5% in the past 7 days. The NEO, NEO USD pair is looking weak as it's trading close to the um, its year-to-date low of $13.6033767. There has been no visible bounce since early August, which shows a lack of buying interest. A break of the support levels will be very negative and can result in a drop to the next support at $6.4781530. On the upside, NEO will face a stiff resistance at the 20-week EMA that is close to the horizontal resistance at $28.4994465. A breakout of this level might start a new rally to $43 and above that to $60 where it might face resistance from the 50-week SMA. Above this level, the move can extend to $100. We believe that the traders should wait for a new buy setup to form before establishing any new positions in it. ADA USD Input Output Hong Kong or IOHK announced that its Icarus project was audited by a third-party independent security auditor, Kodelsky Security, this will proper, um, purportedly ensure that Cardano's wallet is secure for customers. Cardano has shrugged off the infighting as the price went up by about 5% in the past 7 days. Let's see if the coin is showing signs of a turnaround. Now, at the current levels, the ADA USD pair has fallen about 94% from its all time highs. For about a month, and a half, the digital currency has been trading in a tight range of 0 0.06105 to 0 0.094256 dollars. A break out of this range might attract buyers, pushing the price towards the 20-week EMA, followed by a move to uh, 0 0.2 dollars. On the other hand, a breakdown of the range can result in a drop to 0 0.0. Uh, uh, $0.033677. Therefore, traders should wait for a new buy setup to form before attempting a long position on Cardano. EOS USD Hackers have siphoned off 65,000 um, EOS from the operational wallet of EOS Bet, and Gam um, which is a gambling DM. This is the second attack within 60 days, but the traders have shrugged off this news and the digital currency is up 3% in the past 7 days. 
The EUSUSD pair has been trading in the range $4.493 to $6.8299 more than uh, two months. The positive thing is that the bulls haven't allowed the price to slip to the critical support as $3.8723. Instead, they are attempting to form a higher low at $4.4930. Now, however, they haven't able, uh, they haven't been able to break out the overhead resistance, which shows profit booking at higher levels. The 20-week EMA and the horizontal resistance are both at $6.8299, which makes this an important level to watch on the upside. If this level is crossed, the digital currency can move up to $9.4456 followed by a sharp rally at $15. On the other hand, if the bears succeed in breaking down of $3.8723, the virtual currency can plunge to $2.4, followed by a drop at $1.7. The traders should wait for the overhead resistance to be scaled before buying. Alright, so that was for the second featured um, article in today's newsletter. Now, the information is presented for your news, review, and educational entertainment regarding blockchain. So, um, what can you say? Share with us your opinions in the comment section below. Alright, now, okay, um, so that was the second featured article in today's letter. And if you want a copy of the newsletter um, a day ahead of broadcast here on YouTube, you can go to the website preferredcurrency.news and scroll down and click the link PayPal where you can pay 15 US dollars per month on a recurring basis or you can pay at crypto base for only $180 per year with your favorite crypto handled by Coinbase. And after you do that, you start receiving a newsletter in your email 12 hours ahead of our daily broadcast here on YouTube. All right. And um, we have also other websites, great websites that can be seen or that is provided here in our newsletter. One that we have here is the eosauthority.com slash alerts. Now, in this um, website, you can get alerts for transactions on your account, such as incoming and outgoing transfers, changes or additions to the keys, airdrops sent to the account, actions authorized by the account, or any ECAF arbitration notices. Also, guys, the website ESAuthority.com performs as a block producer where it deals professionally with um, technical matters or issues of arbitration and governance. All right. And um, if you have any uh, vacation rentals, real estates, boats, or services available in exchange for EOS, you can post them here at eosmarketplace.news where um, um, it's very f um, it's very accessible and it does not require any membership fee. All you need to do is to type in the item that you want to sell here under the general category column. It's um, the item definition under column C, a website or link for the description which can show a photo or image of the item under column F and your um, basic contact information such as email address and your phone number so that the buyers will know how to reach you all right and if you have um, additional listings to um, you can place them here at marketplace.pcn.today now it shows here different types of categories such as automotive electronics jobs pets and animals restaurants and cafe and other services also, the um, site has an advertisement section where uh, you can um, see uh, two types of ad listings. One is with grid view and the other one is this view. Now, also in this section here will be shown some of the latest ads, random ads, popular ads, and featured ads. And also, uh, marketplace.pcn.today has an ads location section where uh, you can add your desired locations and there is no limit for the locations so you can do it as you would like to okay and also um if you want to get the latest news on blockchain you can go to the website pcn.today 
here. So this is what PCN dot today looks like. So if you want to know more updates regarding Bitcoin or other altcoins, you can just simply go here and all the updates or news will be shown in this page here. That's PCN dot today. Also, guys, um, in each copy of our newsletter, we have Donald's research list where it can show you Donald's analysis regarding coins and tokens. Now, you can get your own copy simply by clicking the link here and click on file on, um, as soon as you open the sheet and make a copy so that um, you can have your own version where you can modify um, for your own purpose and research. You can also add columns, your own personal notes, and information to your own file copy. All right. Now, here is um, my copy of Donald's research list. Here, it will show you the name um, of the coin or tokens here in column A. Now, take note, guys, that the um, green ones have good news. The yellow have fair news. The blue ones have the best news. And if you'll see an orange or a tan here, that's fair. And of course, if you'll see a red one, that's not good news for you guys. All right. Now here, let's go to the date for today. This is for October. Let me just scroll it here. October 23rd. My page is loading, so let me just... Wait here. Mm -hmm. It's not loading. Okay. So here. This is for today, October 22nd. Now, this is the original price of each token. And by tomorrow, um, we'll have an update or Donald will update the sheet for the 24-hour state surprise. And again, for the day, 7-day state surprise, 30-day state surprise. And here on column G is the 24 hours percent up or down. So here, it'll show you for, the, um, for October 21st, it shows here that some of the coins have read that means negative news and the green ones have positive news here. So this is the percent um, or up and down, up or down of each token or coin here. Also here on the newsletter, I show you a um, research list here for preferred currency dot news. Now this is an analysis for tomorrow, October twenty third, two thousand eighteen. Now you'll see here on the first column and column A is the names of tokens or coins. Now also take note that the red ones have negative news. Orange or tan are neutral. Yellow are fair. Green have good news and blue shows best news. Now here on column B is the US dollar recent price for tech, for example, Bitcoin is worth $6,497.27 for each token. Column C is the share of total market volume. Column D is the Google searches compared to the past 7 days. Column E is the 50 candle SMA movement. Column F is number of positive technical indicators. Column G, the 24 hours volume versus price column h seven days weekly volume versus price column i 30 days monthly volume versus price and j is the percent issued now take note guys that this sheet is not a recommendation to buy or sell but if you think that you would this uh, decide that you will like some always consider offering about 20 percent below the current market price whenever you place buy limit orders all right and also guys um you can become an affiliate and earn your crypto each month um all you have to do is sign up here in the upper right corner of the tab so that you can sign up but take note that you cannot post your public links or your links to public forums or 
uh, comments, but rather do it as private message after you um, chat with a friend or owner of another channel or account. So here, again guys, you can go to preferredcurrency.news and click the affiliate tab on the upper right corner of the site so that you can become an affiliate and a blog as an affiliate and earn your crypto each month. Alright, so I, I think that's it guys. That was for the second featured article uh, which is about the top crypto performers overview. Now, I'll be back later on for another article featured in today's newsletter. Now, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel, EOS Marketplace News. This is once again Mia and I'm signing off. See you later.